am here with Jason Aquisto with McFarling Foods at El Toro Mexican Restaurant. We've got quite a spread here, and they're just one of many partners in Kentuckiana that just bring delicious food to our tables like this. Now, Jason, when you partner with a restaurant, what exactly does that look like? You know, it can look different depending on each restaurant and what kind of place they have, but the most important thing for us to do is ask questions, learn, listen, and, 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 and wait before we start giving out ideas and, hey, you want this, you want that, but to learn. The story of each restaurant is important. Everyone has their own story. And then we come back, the sales representative and myself in marketing and then our buyers will all kind of get together and say, well, what do these guys need? What will work for them? Have you thought of this? Are they doing that? And really make it a, a, a holistic approach to, to what would work best for them. I love that. Okay, now we've been to different types of restaurants. You have a lot of different varieties of restaurants. We've been to Pints and Union, El Terrazzo, Home Run Burgers and Fries, and now we're here at El Toro. Is it kind of challenging to take on that many different kind of like vibes of restaurant? Yeah, it, it does keep us on our toes. It helps us to do our best job that way because everyone's different. A pub or a tavern like uh, like Pints and Union is one thing. And then El Terrazzo and El Toro here is different than Home Run Burgers. Each one has their different needs. And so it helps us to keep sharp and to know that everyone, there's no cookie cutter solution, of course. Everyone has a different uh, customer base that they're trying to appeal to. So we have to, to, again, come back and make it a custom solution. What will work best for them? And I love it too, because I know on your team, you have a combined like many years of being in the restaurant industry. Many, I mean hundreds of years. Uh, that's what I think sets us apart and what I'm most proud of is that we've all uh, worked on that side, the operator side, and we've worked in the kitchen, we've worked in the front of the house, and we kind of know what that challenge is like. So it gives us that that empathy and that understanding, and uh, it gives us that little edge to where we, we kind of understand, oh, I remember when I was doing that, here's what I might suggest for them. So it's a lot of fun. Absolutely, and what do you see as the future of McFarling Foods? We are so excited to keep expanding in this part of the country, the part of the Midwest. You know, we've always done business here in Louisville, Southern Indiana. We are expanding that and putting uh, more emphasis, more resource into it. And this coming year, our goal is to put a distribution center right here in the Louisville area and do even more business right here in Kentuckiana. We'd love to have you follow us on all the socials. We have YouTube content. We are on Facebook every day, on uh, Instagram, on Twitter, and, uh, of course, our website is mcfarling.com. Fantastic. Thanks so much for hanging out with me today. From El Toro Mexican Restaurant, I'm Joanne Dixon.